And I can't go on this way Feeling stronger every day But being too shy to say I really love you. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, family. Uh, welcome. Welcome to the mentor. And um, I'm really going to ask y'all opinion today about something uh, from Darkest Secrets, um, hosted by Aga Khan. Um, and I want to hear y'all opinion because I tend to agree with a response that was given. Anyway, it says, I am 12 and I am six weeks pregnant. What should I do? Now, some people say you shouldn't do anything. Say it's your baby and you keeping it. It happened and it is the, you know, the way of the world and you got to have the baby. Well, I've seen this situation several times in my life and I've never wavered um, from what I, I think is appropriate. Uh, this is just my opinion. Um, and I like to think about, um, I like to think I'm not alone. Anyway, the response was, please tell a trusted adult, ASAP. It doesn't even have to be your parents, but you must tell someone, do not wait. I will probably have people mad at me for this. But I'm going to say it anyway. I urge you to get an abortion. You are too young to be pregnant. And it is actually quite dangerous for you to continue a pregnancy at your age. Obviously, that depends on how far along in puberty you are. How big you are in terms of weight, height, bone structure, etc. Pregnancy is hard on any body. It is hard on teenagers. And it is unbelievably hard on preteens. Please think about your own life and your own safety, both physically and mentally. Now, I agree with this uh, response wholeheartedly. Um, when I think about the young ladies and the girls that usually have babies at 11 and 12, the little girls, the babies, uh, that most of the time have been impregnated by old men, old men on the block, or old men in church, um, or the old man down at the store. I will say this. You know, the first thing coming to my mind is I think about Aretha Franklin. And y'all might say, what? Yeah. Because most of the people I know that have kids when they're very young, end up having a situation like hers. Like, everybody knows something is wrong with Clarence. In fact, she stated it in her will, it's the very firstborn, the one that people are trying to say belongs to her father. Now, whether he does or not is not important, is not why I'm saying this. Having a baby at 12 
is pretty much what caused that deficiency in Clarence Jr. And if he's both mentally unable to and physically unable to take care of himself and be safe and live a productive life where he has to have care all the time, then it's probably a situation where either the blood mixed two together or she was just too young. Most preteens that get pregnant, it's not a success story. And I wouldn't even want it to be, honestly. And that's just me. So I want to. I want y'all to weigh in. Y'all seem to be pretty, um, you know, sensitive and and inspiring and 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 um, also thoughtful when it comes to the uh, issues that I ask y'all opinion about. So I want to know what opinion would you give? In a situation like this. Okay. If you like what you hear. As a matter of fact. Before I even go there. I'm going to say one, one more thing. Uh, there was somebody I knew. Um, whose baby got uh, pregnant. Daughter got pregnant at 11. Uh, I was a mandated reporter. And I knew the kid was headed for trouble. So, what ultimately ended up happening is some older men start picking her up in cars and there was really basically nothing the mother did about it or could do about it. Part of it was such dysfunction that the kid didn't have a chance. The kid didn't have a chance. And then to see her pregnant at 11, it was something that had to be reported. And it was something that I just, I couldn't handle it. I was so disgusted with the whole situation. Now, some of y'all might say that wasn't my place, but I really don't give a damn. Because we are spiraling out of control and we've been for a long time. And this is the kind of stuff that shoot up under that rug with that dirt. What you think about a 12 year old being six weeks pregnant? And do you think she should have the baby? Let me know what you think in the comment section below. Because I do read the comments whenever you make them. In fact, um, I like responding to it. So let me know how you think or what you think about this. And I'll see you in the next video.